There is a treasure trove of useful data on your NMEA 2000 network. From AIS to GPS, heading, engine data, fluid levels, and much, much more. But rather than allowing that data to just simply traverse the vessel's network backbone from device to device, there is so much more that can be achieved with that data. And ultimately, that provides more control as well as safer and more efficient journeys. Today's presentation is going to focus on two of our products and how they can be used to get your data into third-party applications both on your PC as well as wireless devices. Firstly, we'll look at the ActiSense NGT1 NMEA2000 PC Gateway device, and that is av available in both USB and ISO versions, used for bi-directional sharing of data between the NMEA2000 network and a PC. The ActiSense W2K NMEA2000 Wi-Fi Gateway also allows for wireless connectivity to a wide range of applications on mobiles and tablet devices. The NGT1 Gateway provides a powerful PC interface to NMEA2000 that can be used by PC applications and embedded products alike to both receive and transmit NMEA2000 PGNs. Most PC chart plotter applications are compatible with the NGT1 USB, however, there are a small number of third-party developed apps that don't currently support the ISO version of the NGT1, and that's something that we've flagged with these developers. Alongside this, having an NGT1 USB in a laptop bag allows an installer to diagnose any NMEA2000 device using our free NMEA Reader software to show the data and decode the message field values and show every NMEA2000 certified device connected to that network. Diagnostics, this is a big subject that can be explained in depth at one of our ActiSense accredited installer training days. The NMEA reader can be used in real time to decode all standard NMEA 0183 sentences and NMEA 2000 messages into their separate field values, which allows the user to gain a far deeper understanding of how data is shared around the network. In contrast, EBL Reader can be used to better understand the sequence of data sentences and messages in greater detail from a recording. This adds another level to the diagnostic capabilities of the NGT1 interface, working hand in hand with NMEA Reader. With experience, both Reader applications can be used to great effect to understand the true root issue and share those findings with other manufacturers so that a resolution can be found. Using our free to download NMEA Reader program in combination with the NGT gives the user or installer a quick and easy insight into the NMEA 2000 network. As mentioned previously with the NGT1, it can transfer all currently available NMEA 2000 PGNs, meaning that anything on your network will be displayed in NMEA Reader. Within NMEA Reader, there is a recording function which logs all the data received via the NGT1 into an EBL file, which can then be analyzed. On the next slides, there is an example of an EBL recording being analyzed using ActiSense EBL Reader and how it can be exported into a CSV file. Please note that the NGT1 can receive proprietary messages from other manufacturers, but we cannot decode them. As previously mentioned, 
EBL Reader can be used to further analyze data and filter that data so that you can see exactly what you want to without the other data being in the recording screen. This makes problem solving much easier. For example, if you have a wind instrument on your network and your MFD stops receiving wind data, you can record this live in NMEA Reader, then analyze the recording for wind data. If the data is not present, then you can determine that the wind instrument is not outputting PGNs. From here, there is an option to export the PGNs to a CSV or decoded CSV. Exporting the recording to a decoded CSV allows for the human readable values to be seen in a program such as Excel, and the data can then be used to build graphs, charts, or any other data display that the user or installer requires. While there are a large number of PC applications that the NGT1 works with, and we can't cover all of them, one that we would like to quickly draw attention to is Time Zero and using this with our NGT1. For a number of years, Accidents have worked with Maxc and NobleTech using our NGT1 with their PC application Time Zero. Using the NGT1 with Time Zero allows for all necessary data to be sent and received on the program. We are continuing to work with the development team for Time Zero to help improve the user experiences both with their application and our NGT1 acting as the interface device. This application, in combination with our NGT1, has been used by a large number of customers over the years with a great amount of positive feedback and user experience. This image is taken from Time Zero port monitoring, where you can see the PGNs being transferred to the program from the NMEA 2000 network via the NGT1. While the depth of information isn't much, it does give the user an indication of which data is being received. Here's an example of a company that has put our NGT1 to great use as part of their connected boat platform. Siren Marine were looking to advance their popular platform by adding NMEA 2000 integration and customized app functionalities developed in partnership with leading marine manufacturers, including Cobalt Bolts, Geno America, ZF Transmissions, and many others. ActiSense were brought in to provide the NMEA 2000 integration using a unique version of our ISO version of the NGT1 NMEA 2000 to PC interface, connecting that to Sire Marine's embedded onboard control unit. Using the ISO version of the NGT1, which comes complete with opto-isolated input and our award-winning ISO drive output for safe interfacing, Siren were able to offer their MTC customers access to the vessel's NMEA 2000 PGN messages and the ability to send a subset of that data to the Siren cloud server via a cellular connection. Siren Marine's unique integration of NMEA 2000 data will now allow their customers to connect their systems directly to the cloud and deliver a powerful, custom-branded mobile app experience to users of their products. A rapidly growing number of forward-looking boat manufacturers, including Southport, Vanquish Boats, Cobalt, Geno, Bascat, and Falcon Boats, have all taken advantage by including Siren technology on many of their models. Using the ActiSense NGT1 in the development of its NMEA 2000 integration, Siren Marine created a concept of dynamically establishing unique data channels for different marine manufacturers, capable of collecting and storing information both on board within the Siren MTC device as well as in the Siren cloud. Data from different devices is uniquely managed for use in both Siren's mobile and fleet apps. This technology can provide manufacturers, as well as boaters, with comparative graphic information on RPM, temperature, oil pressure, fuel consumption, tank levels, and soon additional values such as water depth and environmental readings. Using Siren Marine's powerful apps, users can plot this information in intelligent, time-selectable ways for up to six engines, which is vital with the growing popularity of multi-engine center console boats. All recorded data is then stored in the Siren Cloud, available 
for instant diagnostic recovery. Fleet operators will also benefit by being able to better understand and manage their assets with the ability to monitor and report on engine alerts, fluid levels and fuel consumption. Now let's have a look at what is achievable wirelessly. The W2K is a rugged and reliable NMEA 2000 to Wi-Fi gateway with a built-in data logger. It transfers data from an NMEA 2000 backbone to any device, for example laptops, tablets or smartphones, that are connected to it via Wi-Fi and additionally can convert this data to different formats, including NMEA 0183 using ActiSense's renowned conversion engine. The W2K supports both TCP and UDP data streams so that we can support the largest amount of applications and user cases. One very unique feature of the W2K is its ability to operate in station mode, meaning it can be an access point but also a client to a network at the same time, giving that user the greatest amount of connectivity and flexibility. The W2K comes complete with a guaranteed to be unique Wi-Fi password that is randomly generated during production to ensure that your Wi-Fi network is not compromised with a generic password. However, if required, this unique password can be changed to a user-defined password as long as it's not password 1234. One very important thing to highlight is that in general terms, Wi-Fi should not be used as the core part of the NMEA 2000 backbone but instead used for extra connections that are not fundamental to the safety of the vessel. The W2K contains an 8GB industrial grade SD card which logs everything on the NMEA 2000 network. The logs can be downloaded via the web page or taken directly from the SD card using an SD card reader. As the logs are recorded in electronic binary log or commonly known as EBL format, it means that they can be opened and analyzed in ActiSense's EBL reader. This serves a dual purpose. The logs can be exported to a CSV or decoded CSV file for further analysis, but more importantly, as the device logs everything on the NMEA 2000 network, it means that in the event of a collision, it can hold valuable information if an investigation is needed. Yacht Sentinel, industry leaders in connected boat technology, were looking for the right partner to launch their revolutionary Sentinel Demotics Big Data Solution, which gives boaters the ability to easily receive all available data on the NMEA 2000 network remotely. To achieve this, they wanted to create a wireless solution that could easily be retrofitted to any boat. Using a custom ActiSense W2K1 NMEA 2000 to Wi-Fi gateway, Sentinel Demotics makes it possible to turn any boat into a connected boat by providing access to NMEA 2000 data. The system offers a sophisticated smart switch which can turn the system on even when the NMEA 2000 network is switched off, meaning that all data available on the NMEA 2000 bus can be collected remotely at any time. The Sentinel Demotic system comprises of seamlessly integrated wireless products, a Wi-Fi router, an NMEA 2000 gateway, and the custom ActiSense W2K1. All information is gathered by the system and then transmitted via Wi-Fi or its 3G and 4G connectivity to be concisely displayed on the Yacht Sentinel partner platform and on the user-friendly YS Hub app. For technical installers, boat builders, and those in the rental trade, the Sentinel Demotic system is an invaluable resource for maintenance, remote diagnostics, and overall boat monitoring, 
giving users complete peace of mind. Sentinel Demotics is complementary to their wireless security systems and onboard cameras and adds significant value to shipyards, dealers and fleet managers at an affordable cost. And now we'd like to discuss a hot topic for this year and the future and how it may impact the use of marine data. The brand new NMEA OneNet standard. The OneNet standard for IP networking of marine electronic devices is an open industry standard based on Internet Protocol version 6 and the IEEE 802.3 Ethernet local area network. OneNet provides a common network infrastructure for marine devices and or services on IPv6. All OneNet application protocols, such as PGN messages, are designed to use a standard IPv6 network protocol stack. This allows OneNet to coexist with other protocols and services that operate parallel on the same boat network. The standard also specifies mechanisms for connecting OneNet networks, NMEA 2000 networks, and other networks via gateway devices. Much like NMEA 2000, all OneNet products will need to be certified by the manufacturer and verified by the NMEA. OneNet has been designed to work alongside NMEA 2000 rather than replace it. There are some differences between the two and these comparisons can be seen in the table on screen now. To try to help with the understanding of how OneNet is going to work with existing networks, we've included a diagram which shows a combination of NMEA 0183, NMEA 2000 and OneNet devices all working together. Remember that OneNet is not designed to replace NMEA 2000, rather to work alongside it to improve boat networking. Thank you for joining us as we've taken a brief look at some of the effective ways that you can make the most of your boat's NMEA data. Our website, actisense.com, is a great place to find useful resources, free software downloads, and our full knowledge base of information about our products and all things NMEA.